As I mentioned before, nature in Germany is more than abundant. One can find peace in nature in every corner. We're going to relax near a Kanade Lake, a beautiful, inspiring and green place on the city limits between Bochum, Hattingen and Witten. It is also very close to the University of Bochum. Kanade is the favorite spot of sports lovers. Especially on weekends, cyclists, inline skaters, hikers, joggers, sailors, surfers from neighboring cities come here to forget about time. Also, people who just want to relax in nature. Kanada Lake was actually not originally a lake, it's a part of Ruhr River, just a bit expanded to serve as a reservoir. The construction of the reservoir started in 1979. In 1918, the basin was filled and the official opening of the lake took place on September 18, 1980, with a ceremony for water sports enthusiasts. Today, Kenada Lake is one of the beloved places in the area for Bochumers and people from neighboring cities and villages. People come here alone with friends, families, to just chill or do sports activities. There's a wide range of choices for people. You can sit around or lie on the grass or dine at a nice restaurant or take a boat or canoe, fishing, as well as a pool and sauna are available, a beach deck, a beach volleyball hole. You can even play golf. There's also excursion boat and a passenger boat, which stops near the castle. Runners and cyclists have kilometers of straight, uninterrupted road to pump muscles and do a little overspeeding. From my experience, I can tell, this place gives you energy. You start to think here, and positive thoughts are guaranteed. The chit-chat of birds and various animals distract you from your thoughts from time to time, but on the other hand, you get the harmony of the nature to escape from the city noise. This is something I need to share with you. Kemnada is always crowded, and I've heard that the authorities are going to open a similar lake not far away to avoid overcrowding in Kemnada. A little further into the trip, I noticed a big air balloon. It had nothing to do with the lake, except that it was just in the area. I approached and made a few shots to show you with no comments. Before going back home, I asked visitors why they're here. Nice place, nice weather. <laughs> this, this area is look like in Sweden. <laughs> Where they came from? I'm living really close to this place. I walk on... on... <laughs> He's working over there. Yes. Here in the area, like 10 minutes away from here. I live... Uh, two kilometers from this place. We are from a small town, which is very close to this place. We live here for a lot of uh, years, so for, 40, 40 years. 40 years, I 40 think. Years. Mm -hmm. We yeah. both had studied at the university. Here I met the first students of Bochum University. It was a time where the university was new built. How often they visit Kemnade? Very often. Um, in the summertime, in the summer. weekly. Yes. But not in the winter. <laughs> I don't really come here often, um, just once or twice every summer. Right. 
come here like one or two times every week. We have a special day when we meet, then we make a walk and we eat on, in this restaurant nearby mm -hmm. and so on. Uh, one time in, in, in a week. We're doing a lot of sports around here, like inline skating, or especially in summer, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, or playing, playing volleyball, stuff like that. Maybe once a month, sometimes when the weather is good. And how they feel here? Yes. Relaxing. Happy. Free. <laughs> no, no, free. Free. Free, yes. With one word, it's difficult, I think. It's marvelous, marvelous. Mm -hmm. It uh, uh, reminds me of other uh, tourist uh, regions. Um, silent. <laughs> so I feel very um, peaceful. peaceful and uh, relaxed and it's very quiet and nice to, to, to get away from the traffic and everything in the city centre. Relaxed. <laughs> Relaxed. Relaxed. Comfortable. <laughs> um, relaxing, yes. Because the water is uh, still. It's, yeah, it's relaxing. It's out of the houses, out of the buildings. You feel free in the nature. And finally, please meet the Goose family, a nice big family of these marvelous creatures. I took my time to follow their moves. Ducklings were playing and the parents were carefully guarding them, protecting from the people and getting nervous for every footstep. One of the parents even attacked me when I tried to introduce myself from a close distance. <laughs> So the day in nature's bed is over. For you it's just a few minutes of break, for me it was a break for a whole day. Despite being tired from a long walk, I managed to gather all the best energy that nature had to offer and left this peaceful place behind with no regrets.